Once again, the America East men's and women's basketball tournament will share the same venue and the same weekend. Join your team at the 2012 America East men's and women's basketball championship presented by Newman Zone and hosted by the University of Hartford. For tickets, call 860-768-HAWK or visit AmericaEast.com. Since this is the start of a new season of America East on campus, we need to take a look back at the champion's crown in the fall. In field hockey, the UNH Wildcats were back in the championship game. A year after a heartbreaking final game loss to Albany, the Wildcats disposed of the Great Danes in the semis this season and wasted no time getting on the board against Boston University in the finals. Just 2-13 into the game, Haley Roush put UNH up with their 24th goal of the season. The Terriers weren't going to just roll over. Macy Gaman knocked home her 10th of the year to tie it a little under halfway through the first half. But the Wildcats were on a mission and struck twice before halftime on penalty corners. First, Megan Bozek got the lead back with a big blast. Then it was senior Kyle Lyons to make it 3-1, a goal that would prove to be the game winner. We just knew that we had to score and I was like, all right, no, no excuses, we have to get a goal. So, just shot it as hard as I could. In the second half, BU pulled within one, but Roush helped the Wildcats put it away with her second goal of the game, earning her the tournament's most outstanding player award. And Casey kind of tapped it out, and I just saw the ball and put it in the net, in the open net. Oh my gosh, I just turned around and I was like, thank the Lord, <laughs> that went in. <laughs> the final seconds ticked away, and the Wildcats picked third in the preseason poll, we're headed to the NCAA tournament, America East champions for the first time since 98. We've talked all year that this team was special because of the leadership, and you can't win big games or championships without leadership, and this is a special group. This group of seniors were brought in four years ago to change the program, to raise our level, and that's been our focus each of their four years, and so today I'm so proud uh, and excited for them that they get, got a chance to raise the trophy. In men's soccer, for the second time in three years, Stony Brook captured the conference championship with a 4-2 win over Hartford. Leading the way was Leonardo Fernandez, who set a championship game record for points with two goals and an assist. His second goal would be the game winner, sealing the America East championship for the Seawolves. It is Seawolves red that rules the day. Stony Brook, the 2011 America East champions. Fernandez was named the most outstanding player of the tournament, finishing with three goals and two assists in two games. On the women's side, make it five in a row for Boston University as the Terriers shut out Albany 2-0. Senior Jessica Lusinski started the scoring with the only goal the Terriers would need. Madison Clemens also scored for BU, leading to a familiar scene at Nickerson Field. The Terriers went on to defeat Harvard in the first round of the NCAA. At the Cross Country Championships in Albany, Maine's Riley Masters and Stony Brook's Haley Green turned in record-setting performances. Masters ran the 8K in 24-18, winning the individual title for the second year in a row. Green also set a course record, completing the 5K distance in 1651. Team honors went to the Albany men for the first time ever, while the Stony Brook women captured their fifth straight crown. And in volleyball, another great finish for Albany, who won their sixth America East title in the last eight years with a clean sweep of Stony Brook in the championship. Senior center Brooke Stanley was named the tournament's most outstanding player. Coming up, a conversation with new America East Commissioner Amy Huchthausen. It's about the nine schools, and I think we have a good collection of schools that are very, very strong academically, as well as have found some great athletic success. 